Yo, what is up, YouTube? Gray here, and today <laughs> we've got PTL Week One Battle <laughs> against Ellie, Hello. and uh, do a sort of a different because we live together. So uh, do we? <laughs> apparently, we do. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, we're both going to talk about this battle as it goes on, and. I'm going to get extremely triggered yeah. by what happens. So, um, sp well, spoilers. <laughs> uh, firstly, like, the team you brought was not what I was expecting. No. Like, I expected a couple of things. Jirachi I never expected, because, like, my entire team shuts it down. You had a red bombi. I was like, oh, no, well, fuck that. One Pokemon, and then I have Victini, Zygarde, Tangro, you know <laughs> <laughs> Paporium, Magnemus, Cathagrius. You know, you know, can you, can you, just, the list kind of continues, it, but it does. Can you not understand how much I tunnel vision during like, I don't know why you... I, I do understand. Rebombi scared the shit it, out of me. It's scary, but at the same time, Chestnut has bulletproof. And it doesn't get hit by Moonblast. Yes, it does. I'm fairly sure it does. It does. I, Are you brain I, dead? Hello. Through my entire... I would have brought HP Fire, my dear. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Starting off this video strong, guy. Through my entire prep, I was like, oh, well, I can't hit this Chestnut with Moonblast. But are, uh, I'm sure someone will correct us dead. on that. Fuck um, me. But I was expecting my low take because it literally beat my entire team. Yeah. And it did, by like, the way. Like, even the team I bought, like, <laughs> I was there like, oh, well, I got nothing for it, so I'm just gonna have to deal with the shit. And then you didn't bring it, and... Yeah, I bought fucking sub toxic x cloud instead. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, my plan starting off was to lead with like Rock and bait out your Milotic, and hit it with a Toxic, because then it wouldn't get the flame wall, but it would have more damage on it. Yeah. Um, but obviously you didn't bring it, so I was like... Well, well shit, what do I do now? <laughs> now I'm going to try to like, bait out the chestnut, maybe, because that seems like your best switch into it, and I can do the same things. Yeah. And uh, I don't know what your plan was. Uh, my plan always was to either lead with rocks or lead with Beedrill, depending on what you brought. I wanted to lead chestnut, because I thought you were going to lead with Steelix for your rocks. And then I, I mean, I, Steelix I, didn't care. Yeah, I know, but I could leech seed it and set up my own hazards and stuff like that, and just generally be annoying with Chesnot and leech seed. That was my plan. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah. Anyway, we, shall we get into it? God, yeah, go on, let's do it. All right. So I led with Beedrill because I thought, well, it's a free U-turn and everything, and if he leaves with a scarf, I could just scout it out. Um, I, I mean, you weren't staying in because well, the no, Cellrock would have like, you, you, so. And then the Chestnut came in and I got the Toxic off that I was hoping for. Yeah. Massive Leech Seed is going to get you so much health. <laughs> I think I yes. double Leech Seed her. I, um, I, I think we said, like after the battle, you said you thought it might be even Sash. Sash, Because yeah. it was lead. So you broke the Sash, but it wasn't Sash, it was yeah. Stone Plate or something. Fucking stupid, and yeah. You um, make a nice play here, you double Leech yeah, Seed. Yeah, because I'm not a bot. <laughs> <laughs> You are a smart individual. Um, I am not about to take a Brave Bird, so I think I go out into area here. Yeah. I mean, at no point did I expect to, like, did I think of running Brave Bird? It would have made sense, but... Oh, the crit! Oh, no, hacks! Yeah. It's almost a shepherd shadowing of what's going to happen <laughs> in this battle. At least, like, from that I knew you were Z, and I know, like, yeah. through the whole entire thing now, it's just me protecting and trying to like, <laughs> bait you into using whatever Z moves you had because I thought you were bound to be like Z Stone Edge because regular Stone Edge wouldn't kill me. Yeah, because Mandibuzz is fucking but dumb. Look at that damage, by the damage, way. Huge damage, massive damage. <laughs> uh, then I was like a little bit scared it might be Z Aqua Tail, yeah. and I was like, oh shit, that's gonna do damage. But yeah, that did a reasonable amount. It I was quite happy with that. Amount. And then you didn't know what my set was, which was... Yeah, I panicked. And then as soon as I saw this move, I shit my pants a little bit. And I was like, oh, <laughs> I get 6 would by this. So uh, let it's... me just go right out into my... Oh, wait, it's toxic. So I'm fucked. Yeah, I think regardless, <laughs> like, you probably... Let's just set up hazards in front of a huge threat. Great idea, really. You fucking dumbass. I mean, that did 43, 44% to <laughs> what was supposed to be your check to it. Remember when I had a defensive mon for this? See, here I should have rested. Yeah, you should Yeah, with Heavy Slam getting a kill, because I think Toxic would have killed you regardless. Yeah. Um, see, that over for another curse. I go and into then, this, and um, I'm going to yawn now, um, because he's going to be a pissy-ass bitch and switch out and think I'm offensive, <laughs> but hell no, I go for Torn. I'm not letting this bitch rest up. I mean, Specs is so good against my yeah, team. I like, I had no real switch-ins. Man of Us was my best, <laughs> and it, after Rocks, couldn't take two. <laughs> Like, I <laughs> that's, why I didn't run, that's why I didn't run specs because it didn't need the power to o code the main things I wanted to kill. 
and I thought, had I given up the specs for, you know, interchangeability, I'd be able to play around a bit more. However, I thought of a set that could potentially do a lot of work, which is Sub Taunt Toxic Expert, because fuck man the buzz. And yeah, this is what we're about to see. <laughs> I mean, your team really didn't appreciate Mandibuzz looking really at it. It really didn't, no. But at the same time, like, I have nothing for Aerodactyl on this set, so yeah. it was literally just going to be... free switch into Aerodactyl. Every yeah. As soon as I found out you didn't have Power Plot, I was like, wow, this is just the free switch of my life. I go for Sub here like a fucking man, and uh, <laughs> I think I taunt this? This is literally your favourite move. Yeah. I... What, a substitute? I was like, I was... It's the best move It's going to be game. at least something with Sub. Yeah. Uh, big crit, I think. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that broke without because yeah. we see the knockoff later. But... And then I'm going to switch out to Aero because this is the freest switch in my life. And uh, you are going to knock off because you're a taunted yeah. little dorky. <laughs> if I got a crit on that one, you I would probably just... I literally just would have forfeit. Right <laughs> there. Um, um, and I just get to re up on this because free to body. Yay! Mandibars is so passive and bad. Woo! I mean, it's not bad. It's not bad. No. It's, it's, it's just good, man. Incredibly passive. I double out into X Bar thinking you. I'm, were... I'm still here trying to pay out the C move. I was thinking you were going to go to Steelix here because why the fuck would you stay in with a Mandibuzz against an Aerodactyl like a bad player, Jack? I, I could live a Stone Edge and I was still trying to pay it out. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I go for Toxic on this because this thing's irritating me. Um, and then I think I just boom burst it and a lot yeah. watch watch these rolls ladies and gentlemen. These rolls are wild, like <laughs> this is literally max and, uh, into by the very way, minute. By the way, I sped crap this, so this exact scenario couldn't happen. Get guess fucking what it happened anyway, thanks RNG. Great. Mean... <laughs> it's not like I wanted those hazards to pressure to pressure this fucking thing that wouldn't be alive later in the battles, but maybe. So things yep mm -hmm. so yep you're, you're fuck you you're, you're talking well <laughs> so. um i'm going to be to pressure this thing out because uh yeah it, it's scary it's... and at this moment in time i realize oh fuck i have nothing for mega steelix what do i do <laughs> <laughs> so and... i just go out into arrow here and kind of roost because i mean again that's like yeah it's really free Exactly, and you're on a timer now, so even if you do spam knock off and protect and be and bad. What what I do here <laughs> is so dumb I think it's this turn. No, it's the next one it must be. So you set up your rocks, which is fine, like whatever. And then here I don't know why I did this. I <laughs> guys, I, I don't know which turn it is, but it's a turn. Oh no, you roost up, it's gotta be after this it's one. It's gotta be after this one, yeah. Um I taught you for whatever reason. <laughs> Fuck no. knows why. I'm like, oh yeah, that's, that's cool. I can stop you from roosting, but then I don't protect the next turn and just let you kill me with Stone Edge. Huge, <laughs> so, huge gamer, by the way. I'm, uh, I, I'm good. And then but, I, I reveal the Z so, move after all this time because I'm desperate for t this arrow to do any kind of fucking damage to this big fat fuck of a metal, whatever the hell it is. Um, and it but, does nothing. I, it, I mean. I'm expecting the Z Aquatel, especially when you. I was so close to the Z Aquatel on this. When it pops was... the Z, I'm like, ah, oh, oh, fuck up. <laughs> I'm used to this thing now. And then it was. As it was a Zygarde. As we I was too scared uh, of the Zygarde. I would assume it was the Ice Fang. Yeah, it was the Ice Fang. And Fang, it did. Fuck Zygarde. Literally nothing to me. <laughs> Remember when I did the damage? <laughs> That's a solid so, five hit KO, ladies and gentlemen. If I had cursed up on that turn, not Either being one. so scared, then yeah. we would be in a good position yeah. here. Um, thankfully, I have Stormbreaker Hydreigon because I'm not an idiot. I mean, breaking the fourth away, I played my week two game, and so far from Sleep Talk, I have got rest <laughs> three times out of four <laughs> on my Sleep Talk. So I don't know why I keep running that set when all I get is roost. <laughs> um, here I just sack off. So Why did you sack the I, I was scouting your set. I was like, oh, it's surely she's going to have Fire Blast because yeah. otherwise you really struggle with Steelix. And uh, yeah, I was expecting a fire blast, and I thought I could take that, and I'd out speed, and I can do some damage to you. But yeah. turns out you didn't have fire blast, and so <laughs> <laughs> dark pulse kind of just destroyed me. Yeah, a little bit. And then it... in comes a saucy nuke. <laughs> I mean, no, this, this turn is fine. It, it, I this get, turn is fine. Get a moon blast. That doesn't surprise hey, me. Hey, look, a special you're... attack drop. What I think you're a physical hacks? attacker. Why do you care? No, I'm not. <laughs> yes, you are. You I was. Just... Fucking calm mind! You Wait, said no, you I had meter bash. I did have meter. I'm, I'm, I'm bad. You're I, bad. Week two, I had calm mind and it got crit again, again. By the way, 
Um, Jirachi is the worst fucking Pokemon in the Just planet. call it Crit Magnet. Yeah. Just maybe I should call it that. Hey, I got heavy sound on. Just the top. <laughs> We're just completely like neglecting the battle here. We're just, just on our own a good meme. So um, okay, so I rest here expecting like fire blast again. I was expecting some move from you. I didn't expect you to roost up. Yeah, no, I know. This was roost fodder all day, every day. I thought, oh yeah, she's gonna just want to get a load of damage off on Hell this because no. she can't be otherwise, and then you reveal, reveal taunt. Roost taunt, and then you're like, well, fuck, I can't two hit KO, you know. Uh, <laughs> And fun fact, I actually misclicked there and clicked heavy slab instead of sleep talk. <laughs> Not that bad anyway, because I couldn't use move. But <laughs> and then you switch out into this fucking thing. And yeah. I double out. Expect it. Wait, no, I, I roost up because I'm not that. And then I go into arrow, sacking it off because fuck this noise. And, and he clicks the RNG I mean, button. I, Hell yeah! No, I, I I'm good at this game. I, I was quick with that. And that was that was a good play because you could. It have, was a good like, play. Dark Pulse could have... That was your only play. Like, after a plus one boost on Quiver Dance, I lived with, like, 2%. Yeah. Um, granted, I would Dying have died, turn, but I didn't yeah. expect you to want to sack off your max HP uh, High Dragon. Yeah. Especially when I still got Victini in the back. I was so fucking close to clicking Dark Pulse, because I knew you were going to Quiver. Like, that was your only play. Um, See. But I couldn't risk it, so... Then I go on to my uh, safe that's... switch, my safe switch, my steel type, which has specifically been brought to deal with this fucking Rabombi, and I'm gonna go for Meteor Mash. I mean, had I bought HP Fire <laughs> instead of HP Flying? Which five, you didn't, because you're fucking bad! I don't remember what else on your team I had HP <laughs> Flying for, because Chestnut is weak to it, weak to fire. No, Beedrill is weak to fire, <laughs> this is weak to fire. I was like, I can't touch this, because I got Energy Ball with my other move <laughs> for the Milotic. I'm like, oh shit, well, I'm just gonna have to click Moonblast and then die and then bring in Victini in. But he fucking crits me because he's a cunt. Because I am skilled like that. <laughs> and I lose because uh, Jack's bad at the game. And <laughs> I, I throw a solid K in the chat to indicate this. <laughs> I died to a hidden power flying Rabombi. How does that feel? I'm extremely <laughs> And so. this Hydreigon is just gonna drop like a motherfucker. See, I could have gone into Hydreigon and then doubled gone. out onto it's a fucking Beedrill on a Moonblast, I mean, but let's be honest, it's not gonna fucking. The Rabombi died in the end. The Rabombi did die, but not on my own terms. You got a moral victory. I in did the not end. get a moral victory. It wasn't on my own terms. <laughs> so, and that was the battle. Yeah. It, it was like that could have sucked. Like, yeah. not, like I mean, there's specu we had speculation between between us. Like, Victini still could have won, but I think it still would have been close because knowing Jack Clark, he probably would have missed the Focus Blast with his. It, it would because <laughs> after he took rocks, I'm fairly sure Focus Blast was like a good roll in my yeah. favor to kill. I mean, he still had to hit it. Though. But he had to hit it, yeah. Mm -hmm. And I mean, Steelix may have been ta able to take it on. It definitely took on Rabombi. Oh yeah. No did, you didn't have Drill Run on it, I don't think, either. I'm trying to think of what set you had, but no. I think you, you had, like, Pursuit. I think it. I had Fell Stinger. <laughs> Fell Stinger, Pursuit, U-turn, Poison Jab. Um, which, in hindsight, is really fucking dumb, because, hey, you have a Mega Stinger. <laughs> for some reason, Why did you not I, I don't know. To turn I really didn't think... Because I had, like, everything under the sun for it. I was like, oh, he's not going to bring I... me uh, fucking Mega Steelix, even though I've got a Mega Beedrill, which <laughs> completely tears through his entire team. Fart break. <laughs> <laughs> wow, okay. <laughs> Please edit that out. <laughs> I don't want that on the show. <laughs> and if it is, well, <coughs> you old me. Uh, uh, really embarrassed. Anyway, I will edit that out. <laughs> I doubt so. you will. <laughs> right. Yeah, so. Um, <laughs> Definitely yeah, didn't. We were, talking, <laughs> we were talking about uh, Steelix and. And then just said Yeah, he just yep. decides to. That's probably like louder than out. any of us talking at any point as well. So I'm going to see if I edit that out. If I don't, I don't. So I enjoy that if it's still in there. Um, but yeah, Peg Steaks was literally the first thing I brought. Like, it was I the know. first thing I. Like, it's there. It's the first like, one. <laughs> like, looking back, I prepped pretty terribly. I was terrified of Zygarde. I tunnel visioned on it. Like. I, I didn't for no. At no point I think, hey, I'll bring Zygarde <laughs> because you had so many and checks to it. That's exactly what I thought about Monotic. Like, yeah, I have no checks to Monotic. Well, no, though. but like, you could have brought some fucking gimmick like fucking I mean, toxic I'll... lichen rock to bait me out. Yeah, well, that's my only hope. Though. <laughs> like, Which, by the way, I would never it. have worked because I would have switched into Chesnaw all day every day. But then um, it's still the same thing. Well, yeah, exactly. But, but still, 
wouldn't have toxic my melodic, but regardless, I think the drawback from this battle is that I'm bad at the game and Jack is lucky and fuck Jack. I mean, my luck with NSTL <laughs> last season, I was like, due some luck. Yeah, dude. But, yeah. We don't go into that NSTL season, that was horrific. It How many toxic great. misses were in that I, battle? I, I missed three in one battle and then one the next week. I missed a gunk shot, which I absolutely lost need to hit. Game, yeah. I missed a hydro pump that I absolutely need which to hit. Which lost the game. Yeah, yeah so... Uh, yeah, my luck was not great this last season. This is the game we play, guys. It, it is. This is the game we play. And, I mean, you said you were going for a healing wish, but you also... No, I went for I think when we that. discussed it first, you were like, oh yeah, I was going for healing wish. But actually, healing wish wouldn't matter at all. I think Because both Mons then died to Rebombi. I, th <laughs> so I think for you turned. Yeah, that would make I sense. Think I, I think I, I U turned. Because um, then I couldn't have been set up for a big beanie. I think that was my play. It was so fucking long ago, and because of. Yeah, it was. The, that was like three because, weeks ago now. <laughs> because of the whole incident, I buried it to the back of my brain and hoped to forget about it until this very day where you brought it up. My PTSD I mean, is just tingling right now. Thank you. You did have to commentate with me. <laughs> you just put up a chair next to me. We're like, yeah, bitch, I'm here. <laughs> so, You're welcome. <laughs> but yeah. It's an interesting concept to actually have somebody here at the same time. Wild. Not yeah. over Discord. This is IRL shit. Yeah, I know. That... We would have face cam, but I look like shit, and Jack is in his pajamas. So. I mean, we're both in pajamas. <laughs> no. <laughs> you're in my no, pajamas. Absolutely not. So... I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> anyway, yeah. before this turns into like the complete biggest shambles. podcast of all time, we're going to yeah. go back to watching Brooklyn Nine Nine. So. Uh, Bye. I mean, I, okay, just end my video right here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Go we, ahead. we go one and oh and uh two zero or differential and must be nice. Uh in future battles I will be doing like a post match interview with coaches. Obviously this is a special they occasion. Yeah, they won't be anywhere near as interesting because I won't be in them of course. But Absolutely. still great <laughs> worth a watch because you know this guy's in them. Uh, I'm right. not okay. interesting. I mean you can be on a good but, day. Does this like count as a dual upload? Is this like your first oh, upload for years? But oh, it's just on my channel. Fame! No. D can a... I can I take your subscribers? <laughs> <laughs> All of my very dead subscriber base, which died out about. three years ago when I became fat and unattractive. <laughs> Woohoo! That was really loud. That's going to really that's, peak that's your gonna, own, That's going to break my mic. <laughs> but, if you guys enjoyed that. Yeah, so uh, week two we are battling uh, Matt, aka Zengoose, and the Baltimore guys Orioles. Uh, Hang I think on a minute, that's... this battle was 40 turns. What a fucking shambles. <laughs> Mandibuzz! I could say spoilers, but there's a 100 turn battle in D3. Is that actually? Next week. Oh yeah. my god. And okay. it's, I, I shit you not, it is like six, 60 turns of stall. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, uh, if you ever get to watch that one, then Enjoy. have fun. Yeah, that's going to be a thrilling battle to watch. Um, but yeah, we go up against Matt next week. His team is pretty scary. It is great. Matt's also very good. A very he good is player. The runner up from NSTL with a pretty disgusting team oh that we all God. just let him have. <laughs> so uh, How he didn't come first with that team, we will never know. But I anyway. Mean, I mean, D is good. D is good. D, so. But not quite fucking Hooper Unbound Mega Marwalk. <laughs> yeah, with High Dragon, Nido Queen, and Pawn oh, T as well. Don't. But anyway, we won't go into his NSTL team. He has a very scary team again. And uh, yeah. I guess uh, we will say goodbye see and see you guys. Eddie will not see you in the next video, <laughs> but I will. Unfortunately for you. Oh, good fuck. <laughs>